So this is just in my backpack, but I do have his gulpy. This is what I was talking about in yesterday's video. Basically, once I get through security, I'll go ahead and fill this up. And then it just, it just pops up like this. So I can squeeze the bottle and it'll come out into this little trough and it makes it very easy for portable water consumption. I also have his calming bites in here. I have a his life jacket because where we're going has a pool and so he'll need that. I also just have treats, pet wipes, and his fan and a random golf ball that I just found. Next, I have essentials like his food, which I just got all the air out of. This will go in my actual suitcase. I have his vitamins that he takes every day. He already had one of these today. I have his PetMD chlorhexidine antiseptic wipes for his face or his chin in case he gets dirty. And then I just have a bunch of potty pads just in case, cause he still likes to use these overnight. Um, so we've got those. One thing I actually forgot to mention in yesterday's video that you should be bringing on the plane with you or at least have with you at all times is vet records. So a lot of airlines make you get your pet checked out within 10 days of flying. We actually did that. He had a vet appointment like two or three days ago. Um, so we have those vet records with us. So make sure you also have those if the airline has it mandatory. Um, if not, you probably don't have to worry about it. I know that if the dog is under eight weeks or right at eight weeks, you will definitely need to bring them. And I think it's important to just bring vaccination records wherever you go, just in case you get to your destination, you have to take your dog to the vet for an unfortunate reason and you have those vet records with you. So I think it's important to bring them if you're traveling out of state. Hey guys, we made it to the pet relief area. It's pretty small, at least this one is. Um, I've been in a few of these, but this one's definitely the smallest. But we're just gonna let Monty kind of walk around, um, use the bathroom before we put him back in the carrier. Hopefully, I think I mentioned we have a connecting flight in Dallas, so hopefully we'll have enough time to get him to go to the bathroom there. Um, but yeah, so, <laughs> so far so good. Um, checking in went great and then he got through security just fine. So all is well. Um, we're gonna give him his calming treat now. That way it can kick in before we board. We still have, we got, made sure to get here super early so we still have about an hour until we board. But that's okay because it gives us enough time to feel calm uh, and not stress out about getting there, boarding, getting on the plane. It gives him time to kind of relax as well. So all is well, we'll update you probably when we go to board or get on the plane. See you then.